Yo, what's going on everybody? My name is Marin TM and welcome back to another video. Today, as the title suggests, we're going to be talking about how to get better FPS in Fortnite. And you guys have probably all heard about the guy Daddy Zero by now. Daddy Zero has helped a lot of people out and this is going to be one of the ways he probably does it. I'm not entirely sure. I've heard that he goes into the BIOS of the computer and takes a look at that. And we're not going to go that far today because I am not as experienced as he is. Anyhow, we're going to take a look at a paste bin and a Google Docs document that will definitely increase your FPS quite a bit if you have a lower tier PC. If you have a higher tier PC, it might help you out as well, but not as much. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go into this link. I'll leave it all in the description below uh, for the paste pin and for the Google Docs document. And then you want to go ahead and paste it, but don't click enter yet because you also got to go into the docs documents and go down here to see what CPU you have. And personally, I have a Ryzen 7 uh, 2700X or whatever it's called. And to find out what CPU you have, if you're not aware, basically go down here, type run, go DX, DAG, and then you can see here what you have. Processor, AMD Ryzen 7 2700X, a core processor. So I know that I have this, so I want to copy all of these numbers right here. And basically put them in where this row of numbers is. Uh, but don't take the 22 with it because that will ruin everything. And I have my Fortnite located in a disk that's called M. So to find out about this, you basically go here and you see where you have your Fortnite. Uh, I don't know why I have it on my HDD, but I do. And then you can basically click enter. Then you want to copy this. And then you want to go into your desktop, right click, new, shortcut, and you want to paste it in. Click next and just call it Fortnite. For this to work, you also have to have the Epic Games Launcher open. When that's opened, you can double click on the application and then it will run and it will launch. Uh, it might take quite a bit of time the first few times. And I'm going to go ahead and check it out in a custom game. Not trying to flex or anything, but I'm really happy that I have it. If you guys want to ever join some of my customs, go down in the description below and join my Discord. I do host sometimes and it's a lot of fun. Usually we don't get the most stacked lobbies, but People are understanding and we get some good end games. So check it out. And now I'm really interested to see what FPS I actually have when going into this game. And uh, of course, got to turn this to unlimited and show FPS. In the lobby, I already can tell that I have a little more FPS, maybe like 50 to 60 FPS more. Uh, it's because I have more of a high tier PC, not really the most high tier, but it's not that bad either. So we're going to go ahead and check out Tilted Towers because that's where it's kind of most heavy on the computer. So let's go ahead and check it out. We're diving in towards Tilted Air and I can already tell that 200 FPS while diving in towards Tilted. But it's looking at it, it's looking good, you know, I usually have around 100. Now I have around 120, 130 FPS. All right, so we're now landing in Tilted and we're on... Oh, shit! We just have 300 FPS there, running around a little bit. We're dipping down under 200 just a few times, but that's just how it is, you know? It's, it's nuts. This is certainly incredible. And uh, yeah, if you want to test it out, be sure to do so. All right, so I've been running around in Tilted for quite some time right now. And uh, I have around 300 FPS. And I'm not saying that that's nuts, but that's nuts, bro. That's really, really good. So if you guys want to test this out for yourself, just do what I did in this video. And uh, yeah, hopefully you learned something new today. And if you are new, subscribing is always appreciated. Liking the vid also supports me a ton. And of course, use code Marin in the item shop. Until next time, everybody, have a wonderful day. Goodbye.